वेलकम एवरी वन सो मैनी ऑफ द पीपल थिंक दैट दिस वन इज़ लाइक रियली वेरी वेरी ईजी बट अनफॉर्चुनेटली लॉर ऑफ पीपल गो रॉन्ग इन दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन ओके एस्पेशली इफ़ यू ऑल आर फॉलोइंग बॉड मास और पेम डेस एक्चुअली नो इफ़ यू आर फॉलोइंग पेम डेस ओके सो आई विल टेल यू ऑल वाई ओके सो प्लीज अंडरस्टैंड वॉट हैपन्स इन दिस केस इज दैट सी पीपल आइदर दे विल फॉलो बॉड मास और पेम डेस okay now please understand what happens is that whenever you have addition division multiplication and minus sign according to pemdas your multiplication has to be done first <coughs> then division and then addition and then subtraction so means this is second this is third and this is fourth but actually this pattern is absolutely wrong now why i will tell you okay so please understand your in board mass or in pemdas multiplication and division hold the same importance similarly addition and subtraction also hold the same importance so here you might be wondering acha then what happens if you have multiplication and division as well as addition and subtraction in the question then in that case what happens is you will first do division or multiplication okay now like i said they both hold the same importance so in that case what you will do is you will go from your left to right so what happens is see 1 upon 2 will remain as it is plus sign will continue then this 1 upon 2 will remain as it is and when you have a multiplication sign you change this to multiplication sign but now obviously if you have changed it so means the number which is following the division sign has to be written as reciprocal so that will come out 2 upon 1 or just 2 it will still this multiplication will remain as it is and this minus half will again continue okay so what happens now over here is you are seeing things are getting cancelled so now you are left with what half plus then this is what this is just becoming this entire thing is just becoming what 1 1 into half minus half okay so now according to board mass or pemdas first we will do the multiplication part of it Okay, so that means you will do this much first. So what happens is, see, one upon two plus one into one upon two you had minus half. Okay, so like I said, we'll do this first, which is very very easy, right? You're multiplying any number by one, you'll get the number itself. So you'll just get one upon two minus one upon two. Now see, your coincidentally, if you do left to right or right to left, your answer comes out to be same. but but because this is quite confusing so one thing which we'll always remember is that we will always go from left to right so half plus half that gets you what just one minus half so that gets you what one minus half is getting you one upon two this is the final answer for that particular question now like i said that fortunately your things were easy now if imagine you had if the same question we had which was what half plus half divide by 1 by 2 ma sorry there was not minus first we was multiplying 1 by 2 minus half now if you were following pemdas okay so pemdas says what if you didn't know that we are doing left to right first or we are always following left to right then you means to do first multiplication so this would be be half plus 1 upon 2 this will be what 1 upon 2 into 1 upon 2 that gets you 1 upon 4 minus half so now then we'll do the division so the division is nothing but what you keep the first number as it is then you change the sign to multiplication and then you do the reciprocal of the next number okay so you get what ones are and twos are so this then gets to be half plus 2 minus half so you can do the LCM in this case, this is what one. So you will get one plus four upon two minus one upon two. That gets you five upon two minus one upon two. Since the bases are same or the denominators are same, I can directly subtract the numerator. I'll get four upon two. The final answer is two. So now imagine your what answer we got. Your actual answer we got. Was sorry this page here the answer was twelve or oh, sorry one upon two, and then just by shifting or just by doing your 
this multiplication first the entire answer became what 2 so in this case what we will do is please understand always always follow the method of what left to right okay now a lot of people think that Acha, why did i do this way the actual question was what half plus half divided by half into half minus half we could have done decimal as well so this would be what 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 divide by 0 0.5 into 0 0.5 minus one of sorry again that would be also 0 0.5 so yes you can do that but just remember the rule of what going left to right so we'll again do what 0 0.5 0 0.5 divided by 0 0.5 is simple which gets you one into 0 0.5 minus 0 0.5 now please understand you always have to remember that division and multiplication will always be holding the higher preference over addition and subtraction when your question just has this or just has this when you just have division and multiplication then you go from left to right similarly when the question has just addition and subtraction you go from left to right Apart from this, if the question has a multiplication sign and addition sign, like in this case, and in subtraction sign, then first, first, what your rule says is that you will do this entire operation first, then you will do the rest. Okay, this is very, very important for everyone to remember. So, here what will happen is this becomes 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.5. Now, fortunately, again, here also, if you see, if you do the addition first or you do the subtraction first, your answer comes out to be the same. Like 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 gets you 1, minus 0 0.5, that gets you, again, 0 0.5, that comes out to be just half. Similarly, if I had done minus sign first, still my answer would have been half. That is fine. But like I said, it is very, very important for all of you all to remember the rule of left to right when you have signs like addition and subtraction only in the question or division or and multiplication only okay so now please understand students uh, i keep uploading at least twice daily so if you have doubts please put them in the comment section i will definitely make a video on the same apart from this i'm also going to give you a diy please tell me what will be 3 upon 4 plus 3 upon 4 divide by 3 upon 4 minus 3 upon 4 please tell me your answers in the comment section that's it for today i will definitely see you tomorrow with another video okay um till then see ya take care